Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to another tutorial video for this this one is gonna be me about to join editor on Thumbs on the PC. I I haven't seen how I haven't seen anything on YouTube about how to do it. I would say message someone on Twitch so then they could help me do it because I couldn't do it. But anyway, obviously I'll put all the links down below that obviously that I'll use is to remove things so obviously this is the giant editor obviously I'll, also, I'll put this down below for you obviously you're going to open mod pick the mods that you want so I'm, I'm using this is island map because I will get rid of some a few things that I've got on the map that I don't want on there so this is island there it is so you open that up that will fill the gap it's going ok it will now load up and just like do so it it will take uh, a couple of minutes to load up and then on mine obviously you can look a little circle so obviously like this and obviously these are all the things that you can view like traffic system selling station bales but I go on to this is island and then it'll come up with like a little circle bit which I'm hoping so but yeah, it's just, this took me ages. There you go, you can see it now. The little circle. This, this literally took me ages to um, work it out and figure out how to do it. So there we go. This is the the editor that I want to use. Obviously, if you press your right button on uh, on your mouse, and then if you see the bottom right -hand corner, it says nav nav speed. So you can just turn that up, and that's, that's how fast you can go. So I, I can't remember where I need to go. Uh, is, is it? Is it, let's it this way. So this I need to go over here. Cause this is obviously, this is for a video that I'm doing. But yeah, it obviously last I was up until like half one, two o'clock, trying to figure out how to do it. And in the end, I just gave up and went to bed because it was it was annoying me. But also, I, I haven't seen anything on YouTube about this yet, so I thought I'd share it with you guys. Uh, I can't find my can't find where I, I, I work. There it is, this is hair. So if you click on that, go on to delete. We'll keep those in there. We'll delete that, delete that, get rid of that, and all of this. Get rid of that. And that, and that, and that. We'll just get rid of the hair bales as well. Um, yeah, we'll get rid of those. But for some reason, I cannot see. I can't see the actual um, pig's bed. I could earlier, but now I can't, which is annoying. So yeah, let's get rid of all of this. So I just like do so. We'll keep these bales here. So what we'll need to go over here as well to get rid of this. A lot of bags and this trailer, and that is done and dusted. But yeah, I just can't see why I can't see it. So I don't do again with you guys. So you're gonna file, open mod. Obviously, don't want to say about this jet. Obviously, open mod. Um, finds the map. Obviously, whatever one you want to use, or something like that. I haven't tried it on the vehicles yet, but I'm sure it would be the same as any, as obviously this mod, obviously the map mod. I'm quite, quite certain of it, so obviously that's how you do it. Open mods, find your mods, open it up, and then it'll come up like this. But like I said, there were some pig beds around this farm that I want to get rid of but for some strange reason I cannot get rid of them which is really annoying me 
You'll see it was gonna, it, it would take time to load up, but there you go, we are back in again. So we need to go over to he, this way over here, I believe. I think it's this way. So there's, yeah, it's down there. There it is. So yeah, you still can't see the pig's bed, which is really annoying, but we'll just leave it like this. So let's get rid of all the stuff that I don't want in here. So like that, ICBs or whatever they're called. Um, let's get rid of these over here. I'm hoping this will work. I'm hoping. Let's get rid of these pallets because we don't really need. Oh, I'll get rid of the hedge. And obviously, if you do that, just press the back and that'll come. Obviously, back or undo at the top of your screen. Let's get rid of this. This is a good feature on the PC, but you can't do this on the Xbox or the PS4, which is pretty disappointing, but. I suppose you can do a lot more on the PC and that's why most of people play on the PC for. Let's just get rid of this. So I suppose we could keep like this. So yeah, that's what I want to do. And then just go on to save ID. Obviously it's not gonna start saving it. Well, yeah, I hope this video helped you out. It will take a while, depending on how fast your PC is and how many mods you've got installed and all that and what else you've got on your PC. Obviously, I've got quite a lot of stuff on my PC. So it's going to take quite a while. Oh, like, it wouldn't take a while. It's take like two minutes, I reckon. I'm hoping anyway. I don't want to leave this too long. There we go. So that is now saved. If that's half two, if we just close that down. Go on to yes. So we'll shut this down. Obviously, it's just saving. See on the little circle bit, it's spinning around. So as you see, obviously, it is saved at the bottom of your obviously your screen. It says mop saved in three two six two eight dot eighty nine seven zero zero ms. But yeah, this is a good feature on the PC. Like I said, that's why most uh, most of the like, players play on a PC because you can do so much more on the PC. But there you go, it's now saved. So now you want to go on to documents, um, my games, farm simulator, mods, and that will be there. But what you want to do is you want to get rid of the mods that you've edited. But what you do, do not update the mods on the mods folder, on the mods thing, on the actual farming simulator, and then delete that. Right click on that, um, send to compressed zipped folder, and that will now obviously compressing it so it will become a mod, not an actual file. So I hope this process here it won't take long. And then after that, we'll load up farm simulator. Fingers crossed it will work. I'm hoping. But um, obviously on the farming simulator, obviously if you're using a, a map like what I'm using, the picture won't show. Don't worry, it, it will work. So don't panic, there's thinking I'll just press enter. Now let's go on to Steam, load that up. But yeah, obviously, don't worry. Don't also don't quit your game. It will, it will, it will load and it will work. Also, I'll now show you. But like I said, I, I haven't seen a video like this on YouTube because obviously I was searching and searching and searching and searching, and there was one video that show you how to compress it, and he said put it into your folder and that will work. So I copied that. Uh, done all that and it didn't work and then I had to go on to Twitch obviously watch a couple of streamers 
and luckily enough there were so there you go it is working obviously like I said there is no picture but all you gotta do is just wanna continue continue and then obviously press start like I said it will come up like this with no screen or anything like that obviously you can still see like the title obviously that this is islands and then the things underneath it like you can increase the yeet of your harvest by fellows and spray in your fields so that, that, was, that was the work and all that but obviously I wanted to do this because of the videos that I've got coming on my channel like I said if you're anyone there and you want to see any videos make sure you leave a like and subscribe to my, to my channel to become part of the team but I hope this video helped you out if you are new obviously I didn't know you could do this until like a couple of weeks ago but I, said, I don't really mod sort of thing I just play the game because I enjoy, I enjoy it Obviously, it, obviously, in my eyes, it takes a lot longer than normal because obviously I'm recording and I've got like loads of mods installed on this save, and obviously I've got loads of mods on my folder. Uh, I've got, got some stuff open in the background which I should really close down, but I just never do. There we go. Just press enter. There you go. We are in. So if I was just head over to here, it should have be gone. There you go. So they have gone. As you can see, there was a trailer here. The sheds have gone. Um, that shed there hasn't gone, no. But we can keep, we can keep that one there, though. But there you go. As you see, that has, has worked. But I don't know how to get rid of these, though. Like it wasn't, it wasn't showing up on my, um, obviously the giant. So that that's that's how you do it. But I'll try it one more time to uh, see if it works. So we'll just close that down. Um, so I'll show you again, giant. Edit. Like I said, I'll put this link down below for you, so you can download it. But yeah, like I said, I just don't know. I did a couple of guess, just close on that. But I don't know why I can't get rid of the pig's beds, which is really annoying. So find the mod you want. So I'll go through it again with you, like I said. Um, this is Ireland. There it is. Yes, yes. Well, so I have no idea why I can't get rid of the beds. Hopefully, I can do that off camera. I'm hoping. I can't do it now. Cause that's the only thing that I need to get rid of is the bed and that back um, shed. But for some reason, like I said, it wasn't it wasn't on there when I um, went onto the ed Giants editor. So obviously, yeah, you want the Giants editor 64-bit 8.1.0. That is the newest update. So there you go. We are back to where we left off. But I just cannot see the pig's bed anywhere so I'm clicking the boat I don't know what that was though but it was something I have no idea what just came up but something just got rid of something I have no idea. But obviously, yeah, they're, they're all here. But I have no idea what they would be called. Um, you can see there's quite a lot of stuff that's been added to this. I can't. I just can't see why I can't see the pig's bed. So how about if we done this? Um, open mods. Also, I don't know why I can't see the pig's bed. For it's really confusing. 
Where's my games? What? Hello? File name. My games. Open. But yeah, so I just can't see why I can't get rid of the pig spread. So we'll just try it one more time. If that don't work, then I will end the video there. But like I said, I do hope that this video does, does help you out. Like I said, I haven't seen any showing you how to install it. Or anything like that. Let's just like load up and see at the top of the screen. There we go. So yeah, it's still not showing me the actual pig's beds. So we'll just save that, save and file or the mods and I'll go through it with you again on how to do it obviously how to get it into the game and then we'll end the video there but yeah I've, I also hope you enjoyed the last four videos on the farming simulator obviously on, on this map here working for Billy Right, so there we go, that's no saves, close that down, save, yes, close that down. It's now gonna, obviously there's no loading up to close down this file or this app as such. Well, I just don't know why I can't get rid of the pig's beds. I think I've got rid of one, I'm not too sure, because like when I clicked on around here it came up on the side here obviously i didn't see what it was though i just pressed delete and that worked and that got rid of it so now like i said you want to delete that depending on what mod you want to use and then the mods the one that you just edited will come out come up at the top like this like i said same again right click send to compressed zipped folder so now that, that one i tr tr uh, change out from a folder or a file to a compressed file so it's all together like these ones down here like the pig pen or animal pen extensions workshop work style and all that so this one here it, it won't work obviously if you don't compress it because it is a, it's a it's a folder it's not an actual zip obviously like a zip file or a, or a winrar stuff like that so about four or five seconds to go Obviously, it's just putting putting all the mods, maps, and all that together, and compressing it. Two minutes remaining. Well, that's that can't be right because it's nearly done. So make sure you do it how I just show you. Make sure you, you delete the the old mods and do not go on to the mods on the actual game and update it because it could crash a game or break a game. So just be a bit careful. Obviously always make sure you got a backup file like what I've got. But anyway guys, I'm going to end this video here. If you, if you want to see more like this, make sure you leave a like and subscribe to my channel. And I'll see you guys in my next episode. Thanks for watching.